Ja chcę za, I want to ask such a question. I understand that, that everybody is responsible za swoją, y, na prostotę, za swoją for his prostotę. own simplicity. I, y, za to myślenie duchowe, and, wyższe. and for this higher spiritual thinking. Y, czy jak tam po świecie, if you are traveling around the world and you, you are observing, ta tendencja jest, że jest więcej takich There, there is a, uh, more and more such a people as you. And uh, they, they, they tell me, where, where, uh, where is uh, mankind going to? Where is mankind going to? If you see that this tendency is like, it should be like going down. If you see this, so tell me, where, 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 where the humankind is, 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 is traveling to? You know, we study the Bhagavad Gita very okay. much. Mr. Duyeme, Bhagavad Bhagavad Gita. And the Bhagavad Gita makes one very important point. Bhagavad Gita, first of all, is a very important thing. You do your best. See, I love you have to Don't worry about the rest. Your soul is eternal. Every soul is eternal. The animals which are killed in the slaughterhouses, they're paying also some karma. But their soul is not finished. Slaughterhouses do not kill souls. Battlefields do not destroy souls. We are all in a learning process. And because we love each other, we are supposed to. When I first learned about the philosophy, that you will pay on your own body what you do to others, I ran back to my house. In the temple they thought, oh, he ran away, he don't like it. But I didn't run because I didn't like it. I ran back because I had to tell my mother about this. I said, Mother, you cannot go on killing animals or eating animals because you will suffer. Because I knew that my mother did not know that. Nobody had told her. So, i wanted her to know because I, I learned that from my mother. Well, it didn't work immediately. Okay. It took, it took my mother a few years to become a vegetarian. But that was my feeling. So in this way, now we try to inform the whole world. Because we are all brothers and sisters, mothers and sons, it's the same thing. Why should my mother be more important than you? Of course, when you are Feeding your little child, you're the only mother. But before God, we are all one. One person was asking me the other day, why we are all so different? And I answered spontaneously. So that we learn how to love each other regardless what way we look like. So we should not have speciesism. 
Or ethnic beautyism. Albo jakiegoś piękności etnicznej, że they are the beautiful guys. Blond hair, blue eyes. This is the this is the prototype, the gold one. We want everybody look like that. Sounds like Nazis, no? But there is the whole idea, the all nonsense. So God has made it no. Some of you are going to look this way, some of you are going to look that way, and you all get along and learn how to love each other. Living and learning to give up prejudice. That's what it's all about. You see the bhakti yogis, they are really interested to please God. And you can only please God if you're kind with everyone. No exceptions. Of course, it doesn't mean that you have to give a thief the keys of your house. <laughs> Not like that. 